Hi guys, another science video. This one looks at household substances um, and I just want to focus on a couple of points. So when you do go on to this lesson, which I think is lesson three, um, lesson two or three, uh, next week it'll be getting put up on the classroom. Just thought I'd go through some points with you. So in this case, aluminium, which is the metal that makes up a Coca-Cola can, um, uh, and Pepsi, which uses aluminium for their can, which would be a stronger metal and why might Pepsi not use aluminium for their can? Interesting one to think about and the answer's on the next slide when you do come on to that point. Quick reminder of the pH scale. Acids and increasingly acidic means you're going down in numbers so 0 and 1 are more acidic than 5 and 6. And another thing I'd like to point out as well, this picture of this young chap here, it is possible to have similar or even worse damage uh, to skin. Um, with increasingly al uh, very strong alkalis. So when you're handling alkalis like bleach, um, etc., don't just think, oh, because they're not acids, they're not going to harm their will. The reason for that is because um, concentrated acids and also concentrated alkalis are very corrosive and can destroy the skin if spilled. The location of hydrochloric acid, for example, in your human stomach, tells you and goes to point out that when you be sick, or you feel like you're gagging, when that sick comes up, it can taste nasty and also damage um, parts of your enamel in your teeth if you're constantly being sick. And the reason for that is because the acid is so strong that's coming up from your stomach. It's obviously very dangerous. Okay, and the last thing I'd like to focus on just before we wrap up the video, that was the answers, is this crossword. Now, if you haven't done a crossword before, it's great fun. If you don't have a printer or access to the um, the actual worksheet itself because of, um, again, like you don't have a printer or there's nothing to scan or anything like that, you can just do it by making a jot in your book. Obviously, this slide will be on Google Classroom. And what you do, if we start on with number one, let me just start this here. All alkalis are something that are soluble in water. Okay, so you would find number one and it's a one, two, three for five word answer. You would put your answer in there and then the first letter of the second question, which is sodium hydroxide reacts with sulfuric acid to make the answer would go in this one here. And it is quite tricky, but it's definitely doable. And every year I've done it, students have really like, liked to have managed to get the whole thing. So I'd love to pose that as a challenge to you um, and see who's the first person to come back with a completed crossword. Okay, so enjoy doing that, guys, and there'll be more videos to follow. Thank you.